me maybe keep it a three good morning i'm dina carroll 846 current temperature is 59 going up to 70 today i bet bronzy would love to be out in this bronzy is our furry friend bethany good morning oh i love bronzy she's adorable she's quite a cute little girl she is a three-year-old brindle and white pitbull mix mm. she is um, very playful, full of energy. Um, she's enjoying playing with her toys right now, which is unusual. We don't have a lot of players when we bring them in, but she's ready to go. She um, is. She's very chatty in her kennel, too. She likes to get your attention. Um, she walks pretty nicely on a leash. She has great qualities. She, now, is she chatty in the sense that she goes, oh, 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 or she's like a barker bark? She's, you know she's like a barker trying to get okay. your attention. Gotcha. You know, somebody that walks by, she's like, wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> look um, at me, look at me. Yes, yes. She's, you know, trying to get everybody's attention. Although it's not really that hard right now. We only have about six dogs on our adoption floor. There's, there's you know, not a ton uh, to choose from right now. She's great. Now, you said she was three? Three years old. Is she has SMB. the energy of a puppy. Well, you know, they say that most dogs actually don't leave, you know, pu puppyhood until they're about two. Oh. So, um, you know, she's 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 allowed to have that kind of energy level. Yes. Still. Um, oh, I think that's great. How is she with other dogs with kids? Give us the lowdown. So we don't, you know, she has been fine. Parallel walking with some of our other dogs. We parallel walked her with Jitterbug. Um, so she was good with that. Um, she does know sit, although, you know, you have to find the right motivation. She's not thrilled with the, the treat options today. Um, and she's just nice, calm, relaxed when she needs to be, like a typical pit bull, but she's also, you know, energetic. She can take her out for a walk and things like that. Um, there are no restrictions on the type of, you know, home in terms of children that oh, she could good. go to. Oh, she is delightful and her ears are just, the ears are adorable. Super floppy. Super <laughs> floppy ears. Yeah. Super cute. So if you want to see Bronzy right now, Danny's filming her oh. Facebook Live. Oh, nice. Like the, the whole like mouth eye coordination thing wasn't great there. She's she's not making the, the, the tree catches. So how are we able to take Bronzy home? Because she is adorable. So if you want to meet Bronzy first, um, that is a requirement. Um, you know, even if you were doing a semi-virtual adoption, everybody has to meet the dogs. Sure. Um, if you have, you know, anybody living in your home has to meet the dog prior to adoption. If you have dogs, their dog has to come in and meet ours. Um, and you can do um, just an initial meeting by going to visit fcac.as.me um, to schedule a reservation for you know you and your family to meet her, and then we would go about scheduling a specific meet and greet time for her to interact with your existing dog if you have one. So I know it used to be because when we got Angel from the uh, adoption floor, there was more than one application, but the first application <laughs> fell through, and then we were up next. How many applications will you take on Bronzy? So typically we take two applications for our adult dogs okay um and it's not first come first serve it is the best fit for the dog right um and that doesn't mean to say we you know oh this person's not a good applicant you know they could be approved to adopt but we could just think that you know this home situation may be better for the dog because you know maybe she really likes engaging with kids and they have kids or you know she oh. gets along with dogs but she prefers to be by herself so sure. you know that person may have an only dog I'm not saying these are her instances but those are just examples sure. of you know how that oh, might work um so, sweet. so yeah it's it, it is a multiple application thing and if you know we get one and you know we don't think get more than one we don't think either of them are great then we will you know move on and, and take more okay. um, we're going to do whatever we need to to get the animal in the best fit to make sure it's a forever placement oh bronzy you are so adorable take bronzy home you can see her facebook live on the key with a free radio facebook page you can share the video as well that you live. we can give her a forever home bronzy is our furry friend frederick county animal control thank you bethany key three Oh, girl. For a second there.